with a different video of sorts. Yeah, I'm look, as you can probably tell, I'm out and about. So, let me tell you a little story. Now, I work from home five days a week. Occasionally work a Saturday. I'm off today, which means I'm working this Saturday coming. Uh, I haven't been bothered to do my hair, which is why it's so fluffy. Anyway, yesterday I had to go to work because I had a team meeting. Uh, <clears throat> so basically the wife doesn't work on a Tuesday, so she was at home, decided to go shopping, went to go shopping in the oh, second car, her car. Um, went to get to shopping in, got shopping about the car, went to start the car, the car didn't start. I uh, had a friend come around trying to jump start it with some uh, leads, didn't work either, had to get a car out, had to get the car towed. Uh, so basically the car's now in the garage. Which now, I know the first world problems, but we now have to um, cope with having one car. I know, I know. So yes, so today I thought I'm going to have a walk into town centre of Darlington uh, on my day off. Uh, I was going to go to the cinema, but I, can't, but I just can't be bothered. Thought I'd have a look around the charity shops, plus I've never walked into Darla from our new house. So I thought I'd give it a go. So yeah, so this is um, me walking into town. So let's do some charity and blurry things, shall we? Right, let's go. So first up, I'd popped into Mind. Just having a look at the DVDs, no Blu-rays here whatsoever. Uh, as you can see, there's a few in there, but I did notice that they had uh, Line of Duty, I think. No, it's this one, uh, Call the Midwife. But they did have Line of Duty here, season three for two quid, but they're all already on iPlayer, didn't bother. So there's nothing much in that mind. They did have uh, Line of Duty season three in there for like two quid, but. It's an eye player anyway, it's not Blu-ray, so I'm going to leave that one. So we'll see what we've got and where we're going on to next then, shall we? Right, so next up I popped into Oxfam. They had no Blu-rays apart from one. Deadwood, season one to two. DVD, nothing much here. These are really the box sets. I did find this one, I think Sherlock Holmes one and two for a quid. But I've already got them on 4K, so I don't need those. Um, but yeah, hardly anything here. Darlington's not very good for... Blu-ray charity shop hunting, I'm afraid. Loads of DVDs here. Sherlock Holmes Pride, 300, 2012. Uh, what else have we got? Uh, Marley and Me, but yeah, not here really. So guys, I've just literally come out of the British Heart Foundation there. Picked up um, a bargain, I think. But I guess uh, we'll find out. So anyway, currently on our way, well, my, my way, should I say not on our way? Well, you all will join me. CX, see what we got on there. I've got 18 pound voucher I might want to use, but we shall find out. I'm looking forward to showing you what I got with regards to the Front Shell Foundation. Join me in a minute. So here we are, we are now walking back home. Um, so it took us half an hour to walk in from home to Dalton Town Centre. My hair's just kinking for some reason, I don't know why. Not kinky, kinking. Um, so I had a look through the charity shops, as you can probably see, I didn't do many videos. Because to be honest, dollars are actually pretty rubbish for that charity shop bargain to be Blu rays, DVDs, or anything like that. Uh, anyway, yeah, I did go to the British Heart Foundation in the end and I, my attention was drawn straight away to one that had a display at the top of the stack, the little stand. It was a 4K for 4 99 So I thought, give that a go. Trades in for a tenner. Um, so yeah, so I'll get home, can have some lunch and then I'll uh, check in with you. I did pop the HMV. As we all know, they've got the half, half, half price sale on or whatever. Um, I pre-ordered some stuff. So we shall see, I'll show you, we'll pre -order, order some stuff on that, we'll see what I've got. So we'll check back in shortly guys. So here we are, back in the usual uh, seat, back home, had my lunch, it's now just gone half 12 in the afternoon. Uh, the wife's working until 1, she'll be home about half 1. So I'll show you what I picked up. So yes, going back to what I said originally, uh, British Hall Foundation, they had a bookcase and on the top they had those plastic kind of stands with all individual ones and this one was there and it was sticking out and it was 4 99 and I thought I'll pick it up so you want to know where it is here you go this is where it is I picked up Frozen Planet 2 the new one 4 99 now I know it's a new one because obviously the certificate's different um so I think this came out in the last year so nice slip cover same as it was and then you've got the four discs in it 
so we have disc one 4k disc two 4k and then the blu-rays one and two uh, so yeah so trades in at cx for 10 pounds so i may give that a watch so there you go 4.99 uh, documentary blu-ray so happy to have that i'll give that a watch <clears throat> and then i popped in the um, hmv so let's have a look what we've got here so first of all in their 50 percent off sale i picked up where the crow dad sing it's a film i've been fancy watching for a while um so i thought we had it released at half price so there we go so where the crow dad sing based on the best seven novel i believe there's the disc based on the global best-selling phenomenon so it's got uh, special features, a music, lyric, video, a couple of other things in there. So that's where the crow dad sing. So I'm looking forward to watching that. I might watch that this afternoon. Let's just see. So I've got that. <clears throat> Next one. <clears throat> Is the Bill and Ted Most Excellent Collection. Came into stock ages and ages ago. Sold out. And came back stock again and i think they overstocked hence why they're probably selling it off <clears throat> let's just have a look inside of this one there we go so we have bill and ted's excellent adventure bill and ted's bogus journey and <clears throat> bill and ted face the music so <clears throat> happy to have those in the collection they need a rewatch so that's Bill and Ted's most excellent collection. And the final one. <coughs> there are three in here. Ugh. So the first one, I'll take the wrapper off, is a film that I didn't like at first, but I'm willing to give it another go. And that is Ty West's X. Yeah, why not? We'll give it another go. Just a simple disc. <clears throat> so that's X. And then I picked up, I like the Bloom Houses. I think this is a Bloom House. <clears throat> or it might not be. The next two, people might think they're a bit rubbish, but I thought I'd give them a go anyway. I have seen them both before. I enjoy them both. Bang average, but I enjoyed them. Picked up Breaking In. There you go. Um, I can't remember exactly what it's about, but I think it's the take a kid captive inside the house and she's got to break in. It's a house invasion. And then the final one, now this has still got a security tag on it, is, is it going to let me even actually open it because of the security tag? No, I can sort that. So, Blumhouse's Fantasy Island. Now, I'm going to see if I can sort that out. So, I shall be back momentarily. Okay, yes, finally, sorted. There was a, that thing, it's now come out. So, there you go. That's Blumhouse's Fantasy Island. It's one of those naff horror films, but for some reason, they're kind of like my guilty pleasure. I like them kind of things. So, today's arrivals, or pickups and arrivals, as I'll put them together, you can see here. So, Frozen Planet, Why the Crowdard Sing, Bill and Ted, X Breaking in Fantasy Island. So, whew, that's it. Thank you much for watching. Uh, please don't forget to please like, share, and subscribe. Tune in on Sunday for me and Pete's live stream. Appreciate it. Um, and that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want feedback for my out and back, out and back, out and about, please let me know. Uh, other than that, uh, I'll see you all soon. This is Jody Paul, last five member of my five movies. Sign off and then whatever happens, you know, what we do in life echoes in eternity. Catch you all later. Bye for now.